welcome. So I am here with Victoria Theodore, and we are going to teach. Well, wait, she's going to teach you how to play <laughs> Beyonce's Halo, and it's very fitting because Victoria tours with Beyonce. So you are getting this from somebody who has played it in real time with the Queen herself. Here we go. <laughs> here we go. So this is in the key of A major. So we're going to start by playing an A major triad. That's A, C sharp, and E. In the left hand, we're going to play A and E. So this is just the basic chords first. So A major. And now we're going to move the hands up to the right to B minor. So that's B, D, and F sharp in the right hand, B and F sharp in the left hand. Here we go. So that's the second chord. Let's play that first one again. A major to B minor. Now we're going to move to the third chord, which is F sharp minor. And we're going to put the F sharp, A, and C sharp in the right hand, F sharp and C sharp in the left. Here we go. Let's try all three chords one more time. A major, B minor, F sharp minor. And the last chord is D major. D, F sharp, A in the right hand, D, A in the left hand, all right? It's basically the whole song. That is the whole song. <laughs> Now, let's try that again, just with the basic chords. So if, if you're a beginner pianist, you can do this. Two, three, those walls four. Are Two, three, Baby, they're tumbling down. Two, they three, didn't even four. put up a fight. Two, they didn't even make a sound. Yeah, there you go. And you just keep doing that over and over, and you've got the whole song. You can try it up here. You can even move the hand down here. Let's try it with the hands down here. Okay, okay. Here we go. And one, two. Remember three. those walls I built? Two, three, Baby, they're tumbling down. Two, they three, didn't even four, put up a fight. Two, they didn't even four. make a sound. Yeah. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Okay, step one. Step one. So if you're a beginner pianist, you've got it. You can play Halo. All yes. right? You can even play it along with the recording. What? Why not? Why not? Why not? That'd be so fun. So for those of you who are a little more advanced, now we're going to talk about putting it in second inversion. We're going to do the same thing, okay. basic chords, but in second inversion. So second inversion simply means I'm going to switch the order of the notes. So instead of A, C sharp, E, I'm going to move it up. First inversion, C sharp, E, A. Second inversion, E, A, C sharp. So that's the one we want, all right? So on the left hand, I'm going to play octaves, actually, A and A. And the right hand, E, A, C sharp. So that's the first chord. Second chord is still B minor, but it's in second inversion. Right hand is going to play F sharp, B, D. Okay, I should point this out. Whenever you play a second inversion chord, the root note, the note the chord is named for, is in the middle. So for A major, A is in the middle, E, C sharp. For B minor, B is in the middle, F sharp, B, D. Left hand plays the B, okay? Now we're going to play F sharp minor, again in second inversion, C sharp, F sharp, there's your F sharp in the middle, A, left hand plays F sharp. And for the D major chord, the last one, A, D, F sharp, there's your D in the middle, and the left hand plays D. So let's try those chords again, so A major, second inversion, Remember those walls up in B minor, Baby, they're tumbling F sharp minor, they didn't even put D up major. a fight. one there. <laughs> beautiful. Okay, so now let's talk about the actual pattern that's played. It's so okay. beautiful. It's just a broken chord version of the of each chord. So we're going to start with the C sharp down to the E to the A to the E. So that's the broken pattern. All right? And so we play that four times. 1 2 3 4. Ah. Three and a half times. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So one, two, three, and then this time we go C sharp to the E, and then we play B, C sharp. Three, four. All right, with the left hand. One, two, three, four. And notice I'm using fingers one, two, and four on those notes. 
That makes it easier to move to the next chord, which is the B minor. It's broken again. It's broken again. So we're going D, F sharp, B, F sharp this time. Nice and slow. Two. And then we're going to change it. So it's just twice for the broken chord. Now we do a walk down. That's the basic version. Okay. Let's try that one more time, the basic version. D, F sharp, C sharp, F sharp, B, A, G sharp. Now that you have that, let me show you what it actually is. So what am I doing? I'm doing a, an ornament, okay. which means sort of dressing up the note that's there, making it fancy. Giving it some bling. Some bling. All right, so it's just this, B with the three finger, and I'm gonna put my thumb on the A and cross over the three finger to the G sharp to get us ready for where we're going next. I'll try that again from the D, D, F sharp, C sharp, F sharp, B, C sharp, B, A with the thumb, cross over the three finger to the G sharp, and we're ready for the next note, which will be A with the four finger, all right? So all together, nice and slow, it goes like this for the second measure, the B minor chord. Now we're going to do that walk down. And notice that timing. Da, 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 da. So it's like classical music. You want to have that precision of da, 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 da. Okay? It's so perfect. <laughs> and then the next chord is the F sharp. And we're going to play the A with the four finger, C sharp with the thumb, and F sharp with the two finger. There's the pattern. We're going A, B, A, G sharp. Again, A, C sharp, F sharp, C sharp, A, C sharp, F sharp, C sharp. One more time. A, C sharp, F sharp, C sharp. Now we're going to go A, B, A, G sharp. Do that again. A, B, A, G sharp. So all together it sounds like this with the left hand playing F sharp. Now our four finger is ready to play A again, and we're playing D in root position this time. Mm -hmm. Right, so A, D, F sharp, D, with fingers one, two, and four. And now we're gonna walk back up to start the pattern again. Four on A, three on G sharp. Now we're taking the thumb to A, three finger on B, and we're ready to start over with what? the four finger and C sharp. It's magic. There we go. Woo. Shall we try it together? Yeah. Here we go. Okay. One, two, three, four. going on and on yeah so you put all those pieces together yes and you have halo and you have halo that's it so you just gotta practice your four chords your four chords a major b minor f sharp minor d major and you're rocking and rolling yeah so i hope you have so much fun learning and playing this yeah if you have too. any questions please comment below yeah. and i think we should do a little performance let's do it let's do it Remember those walls I built? Baby, they're tumbling down. They didn't even put up a fight. They didn't even make a sound. I found a way to let you in, but never really had a doubt. Standing in the light of your halo, I got my angel now. It's like I've been awakened. Every rule I had you break it. It's the risk that I'm taking. I'm never gonna shut you out. Everywhere I'm looking now, I'm surrounded by your embrace. Baby, I can feel your halo. You know you
No, you might say even great.